霞の呼吸死の方イリュギリ What's up, everybody? This is a fresh out of the theater reaction slash review of the new Demon Slayer, well, movie, but that's not a movie, to the Hashira training. First, when I initially started Demon Slayer last year, I wasn't totally sold on it, but I was very, very invested in it. And it actually hit me at an interesting point in my life. And I found Demon Slayer and well, Demon Slayer along with other animes and TV shows as well. But Demon Slayer kind of stuck with me. It's the Demon Slayer core surrounds their styles around breathing. So so at that time, I needed to focus on my breathing because I was having a lot of anxiety attacks, a lot of things were happening. I just kind of vibed well with the anime. And then as it went on, I realized how much I truly and deeply loved this anime. I love the story. I love the action. A lot of people hate on this anime. And I get it if you don't like certain things because there are certain things that I don't like. But to completely say that it's trash and there's nothing to it and there's no substance to it and it's this and that and the other thing, it's like, okay, well, you clearly just want to hate on it just to hate on it. I also get the idea behind like the whole quote unquote movie thing being the last episode of the last season and then the first episode of the new season every time they do it. That's a pattern that they do. And I understand. I'm not the biggest fan of that, but I accept it because one, I love the show and I love the series. And and two, I mean, I'm sure we're going to get movies later on that'll be separate from the seasons that it's not just a repeat of the last episode in the previous season and the first episode in the new season. I think that people really need to take a step back and just stop hating on so many things nowadays that are actually pretty good. But it was pretty good. It was the last episode of the Swordsmith Village arc and the first episode of the newest arc to the Hashira training. Wow, I cannot wait until this season actually comes out. Sure, it was a little bit of a build up. It was slow, a lot of talking at times, but that's what a lot of these animes do they have some you know exposition and things that they have to get out but there's a reason to it because then they hit the ground running with the true essence of the story which involves action and obviously setting setting up the plot you know like there's so many things that go into it well i know where we go because i've read the manga so i know where it should go and i'm excited but also saddened because of things that are to come overall i had a great time at just seeing demon slayer on the big screen this is the first time that i saw it in the big screen and it was just awesome to be sitting there watching anime on the big screen and, and demon slayer no less like i really love this anime and as i said earlier i just have like a little bit of a deeper connection with it maybe that's why i love it so much because i found it at a time in my life where i was the most vulnerable i felt very weak i didn't really know who i was and i just found this and i it kind of helped me get back to me a little bit obviously there were a lot more things that went into play for me to get back to feeling like who i really am finding that anime right after that breakup and then getting into it and really really getting invested in it was amazing because it's one of my favorite animes right now obviously there's a lot of other things that i'm way more interested in but this is definitely up there and you know i don't care what people say if people want to crap on it that's fine that's your opinion and hey everybody's entitled to their opinion there's things that other people like that i'm not interested in that i won't crap on because one it's good it's just not i'm not for me you know and that's what i feel like people need to really separate is if this is either something that's just not for you or you just don't want to hop on the hype that it's actually pretty good or you just don't want to say that it's good but you like the fact that it's popular to hate things like i don't know overall i had a great time with it i'm curious to see how they animate what's to come those who haven't watched demon slayer yet please do it is a great time if it's not your thing then what can i say i'm not going to sit here and try and force people to get into something that they don't want to get into but I think a lot of people should watch it. And there's a lot of people in my circle who have still not watched it, who are still adamant about it. Or I may, I've noticed that some people that I've talked to about it make like sly comments about it. And it's just like, why are you following? Why are you following other people and, and hating on this thing or subtly hating on it just because? It's because it's not like other animes that you watch. You can't compare these things. There's different power skills. There's different universes entirely. Like, what are, you, what are you talking about here? Like, Demon Slayer is its own thing. Don't like it, you don't like it. But don't say it's shit because it's not. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's a fun time. So for those of you who have seen it and you share my excitement or curiosity, please comment down below. And for those who are like me that have read the manga and caught up, you know, let's let's talk, man. Let's talk. Let's see where your mind's at. I'm curious to see how they animate everything that's coming or what they're really going to do because, man, 
Some people, their world is gonna get rocked. I mean, people watching the anime, their world's gonna get rocked when they see what happens. Also got my commemorative cup, because you know, that's too. Thank you guys for joining me for this right out of the theater review. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it so you get a notification anytime there's a new video. Thanks again for watching guys. Until the next one.